pretty incredible. All right, camera's up and rolling. I'd like to thank Glenn for coming to be our ground support. So doing a cross-country flight, there was a few steps I took. They're a little different than normal flying out here. Really staying on top of the weather. Opened the weather apps, looked at the wind, see what the wind was doing. Then I opened up a sky vector to look at all the airspace. So some of the other preparations I took for this trip, I have a GPS, have a external power source that's fully charged. Got my cell phone. Uh, what else do we have? All right, we're speed, ground speed's 40. So with this tailwind, we're doing great. So this is one of those points where we could go straight over the desert or up this canal to Rittenhouse. Follow Scott here from above. It's like he's flying a little faster than me. I'm gonna go put my trims out just a little bit. I find myself at all that I get to live in a time and in a place where this is possible. Someone has invented this technology where you have a really efficient paraglider and a strong motor and you can fly and then I can go home and store all of this stuff. Fits in any vehicle, you can keep it inside the house. It's not super expensive. I always say it's in the same realm as motorcycles. This is just such an incredible feeling to be out here flying with your friend, going wherever you want in the sky. It's amazing. So this is Rittenhouse, we're already there. It means it's almost time to cut across the desert. When we first uh, started flying, this is one of the places I had eyeballed to come fly at. But apparently the whole area is closed, gated for reforestation. It's feeling a little bit bumpy over here. Yeah, I don't like the air over here. I'm gonna turn around and Head back towards our destination. Well, we're almost there. It's been really fun to finally do this cross country thing. I was surprised how quickly we came up to Rittenhouse, which was our turning point. And then crossing the desert, uh, we, we miscalculated the effects of the wind. So we came up just a little bit north. We could have trimmed that flight a little bit more. Part of me doesn't want to land.
fun and adventurous. That ending. Well, we did it. That was sketchy at the end, wasn't it? 